What's up, people? Um, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, as always, Team Chris slash Soto Nation. Um, doing this video um, to address some things that happened uh, last night when I did my live shows. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, I did two live shows last night. Um, both of them uh, was the guest of uh, Brother Max Million. Uh, which again, thank you, brother, for giving me uh, the time and to do the interview with you. It was a great interview. Uh, the open panel part, of course, we know uh, at the beginning it didn't go so well. You know, so brother, I want to apologize to you for that because my panel never ran like that before. And I was quite disappointed of all the shit that was going down or whatnot. So I'm doing this video, you know, just to address some uh, issues. Um, I had something unusual that happened last night during the last show is uh, I had trolls coming in. I just got rid of one troll. And I haven't heard from that person anymore. And shit, I had uh, like three or four of them coming last night. So I was wondering where the fuck they coming from, you know, because who am I, you know, for you to troll, you know. Um, then I find out somebody in the audience had went to another panel and caused some commotion, where the case may be, which brought the commotion back over to my show and it cost the trolls to troll in my show or whatnot you know um this shit just got kind of crazy and it was it was almost embarrassing not because of the trolls you know i could deal with the trolls but it was just embarrassing you know for the people who was trying to participate in the second part um it it started off horrible, very horrible. So I'm apologizing to the audience that participated because uh, during the show, little did I know, I was getting messages from people saying they was leaving the show. They couldn't stand and watch what was going on. And that's not good. That's not good at all. Because usually I get better messages than that. I get messages of people telling me how they enjoy my shows. But to get messages or somebody telling me they're leaving the show because of the shit that was going on, that's not seen too well with me. Not at all. So, let me address these couple of issues. Um, and get my, I'm going to get my show back in order. You know, because uh, I guarantee you, I'm not going to have another night like that at all. So, I'm going to address the issues right now. And with all due respect. But at the same time, take how you want to take it, you know. Um, if you're drunk, don't come on my panel. I'm sorry, I just can't do it. Don't come on my panel. Or let me so say you're drunk and you can't hold your liquor, don't come on my panel. If you're high, you can't hold your high, don't come on my panel. You can sit in the chat room all you want to, don't come on my panel. Um... If you're going back between shows, don't come back and send me messages and shit about what somebody doing on somebody else's panel. Because if they if they not addressing Chris Thorns, then I really don't want to hear the shit. To be honest, I really, I really don't want to hear it. Or let me say this: don't be sending me messages about what's going on on another person's panel while I'm live. You know, show some respect and do it in a private manner. These was pretty much the issue that was going on last night. They made the thing totally horrible. Horrible. And if y'all haven't seen it, then go take a look and you pretty much see what happened. You know, and, um, you know, I'm still a little disappointed right now, but, you know, it's a brand new day. I get over, you know, I mean, I ain't another show better move, you know what I'm saying, but 
like I said, I'm addressing this stuff right now. This shit is not going to happen again. I apologize to um, my supporters, my subscribers for what happened last night. You know, all that was unexpected. And I'm still kind of confused where all that come from. I'm getting different stories on how all that shit came about. But I'm really getting to the point now where I'm like, you know, I really don't give a shit how it came about. I just know I'm changing that shit right now. It's not going to happen anymore. And I believe a lot of people are really shocked on how I was going off about it. Yes, I'm going off about it because I was pissed. I was very pissed about what happened last night. So again, if you're drunk, you can't hold your liquor, don't get on my panel. If you're high, you can't hold your high, don't get on my panel. If you're going back and forth trying to find out what's going on between the other folk shows and all that, don't bring that shit over there to me. Just as simple as that. I don't want to hear it. You know, because the way I look at that, you're trying to put me in a battle that's not mine. So, I appreciate you. You show me their respect. And when I'm live, don't don't bring no problems to me about what somebody else doing over somewhere else. Okay, it got nothing to do with me. But to my fans, to my subscribers, the ones who always is saying they enjoy my shows and all that. Again, I deeply humbly apologize. But I'm letting y'all know right now, it's not going to happen again. You best believe that. And I'm dead serious. This shit is not going to happen again. And I mean what I say. And I say what I mean. Show me respect like I show y'all. Alright? Peace. Love y'all. Team Chris.